I'm excited to be doing the announcements this week so I can personally thank each of you for your participation in Harvest Festival last weekend. Whether you prayed for the event, provided candy, worked a carnival booth, decorated your car, worked security, or filled any number of other volunteer spots, let me say, Thank you. Over 1,500 people from our community came on our campus and experienced the love of Jesus through all of you. If you want to see the memories that were captured in pictures, head to our FPB app and click on Photos to view the Harvest Festival photo album. If you picked up an Operation Christmas Child shoebox last Sunday during Mission Sunday, don't forget to fill it and return it by next week, November 12th. You can visit the Operation Christmas Child website if you need tips on how to pack your box. Thank you for being a blessing to a child this Christmas. Also on November 12th, our missions team will be holding an information meeting for the Thailand mission trip, which is scheduled for April 3rd through the 16th, 2024. Come find out the details as we partner with Children to Love to continue our mission to bless the world. Now you know what to do, family. It's time to record your presence with us, whether you're in person or watching online. You can fill out your yellow card on the FPB app or by scanning the QR code or filling out a hard copy, both of which can be found in the lobby. And don't forget to let us know if you're interested in other ministry opportunities or have a prayer request. And if you came prepared to give this morning, you'll find tithe or offering boxes in the gym, or you can visit our app or website to give electronically. Thank you First Press for giving generously in response to the generosity that is lavished on us by our Savior. Well, that's all for me this week. We have some exciting things coming up in November and December. Visit our website or the Church Life section of our app to see all of the details. Have a great week, First Press family.